One village, one dam program. This is the first phase of the program. We are uh, doing 10, ten uh, dams for the Bongo constituency. 10, sir. Uh, this is the first, uh, one of the first that we are doing here. The first phase of it is uh, the 10 dams that we are doing. And the first phase has, uh, is mainly access, uh, water, uh, access of water to the rural communities. We are, we are not including the irrigation aspects in the first phase. The second phase, we are going to do the. They are going to include irrigation uh, uh, and uh, crops. The first phase is only animals and the rural, uh, domestic consumption. The second phase will come in with the irrigation uh, aspects of it. What's the reason for the distinction? So, uh, the rural areas are demanding a lot of water immediately, and then uh, most of the dams that we are doing here are inside the communities. We will not be able to get. Uh, irrigable lands within the community, but a second phase, which will be bigger, will include irrigable lands downstream, and we are going to include, uh, we are going to develop them on bigger valleys, which will include uh, irrigable lands for irrigation, sir. What's, what's the program? Give us a yeah. Yes, this first phase will end at the end of this year. It's supposed to have ended in August, but because of rains, we might be delayed a little, but it will end in December, and the first, the second phase will start early next year.
the history of constitutional rule, this is the first time that a sitting president has visited Bongo. In the past, presidents come here only during campaign seasons. I must commend you for visiting us during your first two years in office. The chiefs and people of Bongo salute you for demonstrating the spirit of Father for All by ensuring that the bongo Bolga road that was left uncompleted has now been completed. Our greatest appreciation to you is for your swift attention to work on the bongo Balungo road that has left the people cut off from traveling in and out. Your Excellency, a total of 78.9 kilometers stretch of feeder roads are currently under construction in various parts of the district. The construction of the one village, one dam, where Bongo has taken the lead in the region, the implementation of the free SHS policy, etc., etc. Your Excellency, Rome was not built in a day, as the saying goes. Therefore, I'm hopeful that more development projects will take place since we have the right regional minister and hard-working district chief executive for the Upper East Region and Bongo District, respectively. When we came, we said that there were many things that we had promised the people of Ghana that we would do. At the time, we were making those commitments. Our opponents said that I was lying to the people of Ghana. The things that I said I wanted to do I couldn't do it, and that I was only saying them to get votes. Well, we're one and a half years later. Free secondary high school education in Ghana is today a reality for the people of Ghana. Last year, it meant that 90,000 more students entered secondary school than the year before. This year, the number is doubling. It will be 180,000 more students are coming into the secondary school system than have become before. So we are fulfilling our promise. And we're making it clear that senior high school education as free is here to stay in Ghana forever and ever. We're going to have to find imaginative ways of making sure that this big population of students is catered for. One of the things that we're going to do is to employ 8,000 more teachers so that they can look after our children and give them a decent education. We have also restored the nurses' training allowances. We have restored the teacher training allowances. We have begun the One Village, One Dam initiative. And you here in Bogo can see for yourself that we have begun the initiative. It is our intention that Bongo alone will get 10 dams this year. 570 are being built. You heard the minister across the three northern regions. And Bongo constituency alone is going to get 10 out of that 560, 570. At long last, the Bongo Balungo Namon Road has been given out to contract. 
and it's going to be commissioned, was commissioned by me today, and it's going to be completed within one year. This is not some election year.